God lives and works today. He has a wonderful plan for each person's life because He is a Father of love. Do you know anything about His plan for your life? If you do, you can be comforted in the difficult situations and dark days of your life. However, if you must sadly answer that you don't know about His plan, listen to the following meditation by Basilea Schlink. Don't we all know hours in our lives in which we don't see any way to go on when all our hope has died? At such times, the waves of darkness break over our heads and we complain, I just can't go on. There's no more way and no more help. I'm at the end of my rope. I've prayed, but everything's the same and my problems just haven't been solved. What can we do in such times? Listen to the words of Jeremiah in chapter 29. I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord, plans for welfare, not for evil, to give you a future and a hope. With these words, God is saying to us, I have a plan for you right now, when everything seems so dark and hopeless. And when I make a plan, I carry it out. Your discouragement is not the end. If you've ever been on a mountain hike, you know it's impossible to leap from one high place to the next. After you've reached one peak, you must first climb down a bit before you can begin to climb up to the next one. However, God has made us a wonderful promise. I have a plan for every human life, and my plans do not end with your sitting forever at the bottom of the mountain. It's not my plan for you to wallow in despair as if despair were the end, and there were no more hope for your life. No, in God's plan there is a future waiting for you, and it's filled with hope. It's the city of God where Jesus has his throne and is waiting for you. From there he's calling to us, bravely go on, even though you're sitting at the bottom. Begin to climb towards the top of the mountain before you now. I have a wonderful plan for your life. You will not only reach the top of the next mountain, but then you will also reach the final goal, the golden city. God's plans will be carried out, and he will bring them to a glorious victory in your life too. You have been listening to a program written by Basile Schlink of the Little Land of Canaan. To learn more about how God lives and works today, visit us at our website, www.canaan.org. That's K-A-N-A-A-N dot org. If you contact us, we would be happy to send you a free inspirational booklet. If you do not have access to the web, please contact this radio station for our postal address. God bless you.